Mitch, two on defeat today, what's your thoughts on the performance? Um, disappointing. Um, I thought, yeah, we definitely deserve something out of the game. Um, frustrating to lose in the way we did, uh, but it's the National League, it's fine margins. People have watched and been part of this long enough to realise that the games, they're not normally 1, 2-0, 3-0, 4-0, they're fine margins. And at the moment, a little bit of our own fault, and I don't want to say luck, but there's things aren't going our way, but the only thing we could do is stick together, stay positive, work it out and, and put it right. Because everyone in there is hurting, I'm hurting, the staff's hurting. Um, and yeah, we've got, got to make sure we put it right. It will come, yeah, everyone's just got to stick together. Let's take it back from the start, obviously, you know, game starts and we take, find ourselves one nil up through Kinsey's corner and Giles' header. It's a great way to start the game and we were the team on the front foot. Yeah, definitely. Um, yeah, I, I thought first half we, we looked okay. I didn't think it took us a little while to get going. 15 minutes or so, I thought Solly Hall were on top. Um, but after that, I, I thought we showed what, what we're good at. Um, sort of the counter attack, sort of, yeah, soaking up pressure and hit, hitting them on the counter attack. And I thought we were well worthy of our goal. Um, to obviously concede just for half time, again, a little bit of naivety from our point of view. Um, it should have never really happen um, that close to half time, but it did. We've spoke about it, we're going to learn from it and we're going to put it right. Um, and then second half, it, it was open, it was, it was a close game, um, either team could have nicked it and unfortunately, I haven't seen the second goal back, but it just looks as though we had a little bit of unfortunate um, on the, it's, it's, uh, the halfway line. The, the bounce favoured them, um, they broke and yeah, they, they kind of, they broke and, and scored. So, as I say, very frustrating, um, it, it hurts as all the other four losses that we've had so far did, but We've had a good chat in there as a group, and we're, we're going to make sure we put this right. I think that's the thing for the fans as well. Obviously, you know they they want a team they want to be proud of, and obviously you boys want to put on a show for them and make sure that it's a team they're proud of. So, moving forwards, obviously five defeats. What do we do now to make sure this doesn't keep happening? We we just need to liven up everywhere. Um, I, I feel very sorry for the staff, to be perfectly honest with you, because I sort of heard obviously the, the reception that the fans were given out there. Um, to the Gaffin staff, but I tell you this now: that everything they do for us, they they do, they could not do more for us. Um, the Gaffer, Annie, the rest of the staff, everything we need to su succeed is there. Um, we as players need to take a little bit more, a lot more responsibility, and put it right because they prep us the best they can. And when we go on the pitch, that they 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 can't really do too much. I know obviously substitutions and things like that, but it's, it's down to us when we go onto the pitch. Um, so we all need to take a real long, hard look at ourselves and make sure. Are we doing everything we possibly can to make sure that come a Saturday, come a Tuesday night, we're in the best possible form to start picking up these wins? Uh, we've, as I said, we've had a real good chat in there. I think a few home truths have been said, um, and yeah, we're gonna we're gonna lick our wounds. But tomorrow is a fresh day. Monday's a fresh day, and Tuesday we've got another game. So everyone now is looking forward to it, and we're gonna put it right on Tuesday. Because of course, it is a quite young squad in there as well, with a lot of young players hoping to make a name of themselves in the National League. For you guys, and more experienced players, you know, Kins, Kev, yourself included. Yeah. It's important you get around those boys, and make sure listen to this football. But you know, the results will come. And we'll keep working hard on what we need to do. Definitely, we, we are a young side, yeah. But that, that's for me, that doesn't make it a weakness um, at all. If, if anything, it'd be a strength. We, we have high, high energy. Um, it's, it's not about making excuses at the moment, it's, it's about us really, as I said, looking in the mirror and making sure we put it right because everything at the club's done right. Um, us as players just have not been performing to the maximum of our ability in the first five games and we, as I said, we're going to make sure we, we do everything we can to put it right on Tuesday. Exactly that, and looking ahead to Tuesday, South End away, a new test for us in this league for a little while, but yeah. it'll be a good one nonetheless. Of course it is, it's, it, yeah, it, it, I've, I haven't played at South End before, it's, it's another stadium that I haven't played at. Um, went there when I was a kid with my granddad, so it would be nice to sort of revisit it. Um, but yeah, it's, it's but on paper, they're one of the toughest teams in the league. However, that doesn't make a difference because every single team in this league is difficult. If we apply ourselves and we, we do what we know we're capable of and we've shown in spells in the last five games, I'm very confident that we'll get a result there. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information. Click here for the next video. Click here to subscribe.